In a controversial move amidst Zimbabwe's deepening economic crisis and declining healthcare standards, Mr. Emerson Dambudzo Mingagwa has allocated luxury vehicles to the ZANU PF Youth League, purportedly to support youth empowerment initiatives. According to a ZANU PF insider who spoke on condition of anonymity on Wednesday, the party's youth league received a fleet of posh vehicles directly from the president. This allocation, which includes high-end cars, comes at a time when the country grapples with severe economic challenges marked by hyperinflation, unemployment, and shortages of essential goods. The decision has sparked widespread criticism from opposition parties, civil society groups, and ordinary citizens who argue that such lavish expenditures are tone-deaf and insensitive to the everyday struggles faced by the majority of Zimbabweans. Many have pointed out that the funds could have been better utilized to address pressing issues such as healthcare infrastructure, education, and poverty alleviation. The timing of this allocation couldn't be worse, remarked one political analyst, highlighting the contrast between the government's spending priorities and the urgent needs of the population. While the youth empowerment is important, there are more pressing priorities that demand immediate attention especially given the current state of our economy and healthcare system. Critics have also raised concerns about transparency and accountability regarding the acquisition and allocation of these vehicles, urging authorities to disclose the full details of the transaction and justify the expenditure in light of the country's economic realities. Meanwhile, the ZANU PF Youth League has defended the move asserting that the vehicles will enhance their capacity to mobilize and engage with young people across the country. They emphasize that the initiative is part of broader efforts to empower youth and strengthen grassroots support for the ruling party. As public debate intensifies, the controversy surrounding Mingagwa's decision underscores deeper frustrations over governance and economic management in Zimbabwe. With social discontent on the rise amid deteriorating living standards, the allocation of luxury vehicles to the ZANU PF Youth League is likely to remain a contentious issue, reflecting broader concerns about priorities and equity in national resource allocation.